I want to make sure that Colorado remains a state where the government and bureaucrats don't insert themselves into that very private and difficult conversation between a woman and her doctor. Ms. Gennar, go ahead. Again, I will put that to a vote of the people of Colorado. And yes, I do think it's terrible to abort a baby in the final weeks of pregnancy. Well, what, what, did their, what did the ripping up mean? I mean, would you it put that to vote I people to rip it up, or would you rip it up? Abortion, and I do believe Roe versus Wade should be a state's decision. And Colorado has spoken. You passed a law without the will of the voters, and I would like to go back to the voters of Colorado to find a compromise. But also, if you care so much about women's health care choices, how come you fired so many women health care workers because they didn't feel comfortable getting a vaccination during COVID? Governor, you choose to respond. Well, I, look, Colorado remains a state where, you know, we have friends that haven't been vaccinated and friends who have. I certainly encourage it. I've been vaccinated. Did they lose I their job by you? The Omicron. Did you fire them? Uh, no, state, state workers, they had to, there was, there was a period of time during the midst of the pandemic where they either got tested or they had the vaccine. You either believe um, in women's health care choices or not. Well, I, I am opposed, and I have been opposed, and you know I have been, to vaccine uh, requirements. I even negotiate. Why didn't you put your foot down? You're in charge. You're the because governor. Because it's not about rhetoric. It's about encouraging people to do the right thing. I bet there's people here who didn't get vaccinated. Jared, I've met with many vaccinated? women no. healthcare have workers. Have you been vaccinated? Have you been vaccinated? Yes, I have. Okay, and thank you for agreeing with me that we shouldn't force others to get That's vaccinated. That's my own personal decision. Okay, we, we're